everyone and welcome back to my channel today I'm going to be doing a French pharmacy cosmetics I posted a picture on Instagram letting you guys know that I was in France and I was asking for some advice from you what are your favorite French cosmetic brands and makeup or skincare that I should pick up well, while in France, I ended up only picking up um, skincare because that was what I was mostly interested in. And thank you so much for your speedy response. It really helped because I was in Saarbrücken on business and then it was like 15 kilometers to drive to France. Actually, from where I live to France is maybe about two hours. So I, it's something that I should be doing more often, driving to France and picking up cosmetics and shopping for groceries. So anyway, my first shop in France was at um, Cora. It's like a big um, supermarket like Walmart. And the first thing I wanted to pick up was some French magazines because when they get to Germany they can cost quite a bit <laughs> and I picked up the new L magazine the French L and this just costs like two euros 90 cents if I was to buy it here in my city I would be paying maybe 10 12 euros at my newsstand which is insane considering that the original price is only two euros and 90 cents with the L magazine came another magazine called B which I am very happy about because they have a lot of accessories bijou sacks all kinds of accessories inside of it and I'm so excited and I was really inspired by the nude color that this model is wearing she's so beautiful so I can't wait to try out the makeup look that she is sporting and I picked up two magazines so I'm happy about that while in the Cora supermarket or I think they call it mache <laughs> I'm not sure I picked up a huge can of Avian um, facial spray and this is 400 milliliters. Normally in Germany for the smaller size, I would pay maybe around six or seven euros. And so I was really happy to get this huge tin for only three euros and 95 cents. And I really love the Avian spray, especially in the summer when it's really hot. You can spray yourself down with this to cool off or you can use it to refresh your makeup, which is probably what I'm going to do with it. And I love these thermal waters. The next thing I picked up was a cleansing water from Garnier. Now, I did not know that Gagne has um, a skincare line. I had no idea. It was nice for me to see them having the cleansing water. Um, it is good for your face, eyes, and lips, and it does not contain perfume. It's not perfumed at all. It's fragrance-free, and it's also dermatology tested. So I'm very excited to try this out and see how it compares to my other cleansing waters. If you have tried this before I'm kind of curious as to what you think about it on the topic of cleansing waters of course you guys recommended on Instagram that I picked up the Bioderma so I picked up two normally if you buy the double pack um, that's what I love about France it's a lot cheaper and there were quite a few pharmacies near the border there was this one called I think Bellevue Apotheca so it was half French, half German. <laughs> it was quite funny. Well, anyway, there were quite a few um, pharmacies around. So I picked up two of the Bioderma. I started using this one already. This is the makeup remover that does everything. You can use it for your um, face, your eye makeup, and your lips. And it's really good. And I do highly recommend this. And it is fragrance free. And it is one of the best cleansing waters that I've ever tried out so I'll see how this one from Garnier compares to this but this will run you maybe 
uh, 16 to 20 euros depending on where you live or if you buy it in France then of course it's a little cheaper and this from Garnier only cost me 4 euros and 50 cents so I'm curious to see how they kind of match up so a lot of you also recommended that I try out a brand which I've never tried out before called Aven and I picked up three products from Aven the first one I picked up was the thermal water. It's supposed to soothe the skin and it's also hyperallergenic. I don't know how different this is from the one that I've been using from Cuddly or my Avian water and so I'm curious to try out this, very curious. The next thing I picked up was a cleansing gel and this one is also from Avin and this is especially for sensitive skin and I have dry skin and sometimes I get patches I'm going to be using this with my Clarisonic so I can't wait to see how this one works out for me the cleansing gel from Avin next from Avin I picked up their peeling it also has German and French writing on it it says Mildes Reinigendes Peeling for empfindlicher Haut so that just means that it's appealing for very sensitive skin and I can't wait to try it out it's supposed to be a very gentle peeling this is also um, hyperallergenic if you are interested and some of you also recommended that I try out this brand I've never tried anything from them before actually I use this so I can tell you how I like it already this one is from La Roche Posay this is their moisturizing cream it also has a UV protection it's a daily moisturizer you use this morning and night and I used it today underneath um, my foundation I wanted to see if it was if it had an oily consistency or anything like that so I applied my serum first and then I added this over it and then I did my makeup as I regularly would and it really hydrates the skin and it doesn't leave that oily film that we hate. This thing performs very well. I like this one already. You guys should check this out. And it's also paraben free and of course it's dermatology tested and hyperallergenic and all of that good stuff. And last but certainly not least, I went to the Muji store and I picked up something really huge. I am so excited that my Muji store always have products in stock and I don't have to wait. So I got the five drawer cube from Muji. I love these Muji containers. If you watch my makeup collection and storage video, you will see me using a lot of these. And if you haven't seen that video yet, I'll link that for you below. Well, I bought the five drawer because I want to use it to store my lipsticks and mascaras because I do have a little bit of a growing collection. I am also trying to edit my collection and you know that I'm the kind of person that don't like having way too much makeup because then I don't know exactly what it is that I have. So these drawers definitely help me organize my pieces and I paid 37 euros rose for this the price has definitely gone up some I think it's still one of the most affordable ways to store your makeup and having them look neat so I love my five drawer from uh, Muji by the way don't forget to check me out on Facebook and Instagram I'm always very active there I will have that linked below and for all my makeup of the day that I'm wearing in this video or tops or jewelry if you're interested I will also link that down below. So that completes my French um, pharmacy haul. I love you for watching. Bye everyone. Das ist der alles Könner unter Make-up entferne. <laughs> this is the makeup. <laughs> that is too funny.